welcome to Biomade Elementary. I am Mr. David, and I am into things like Star Wars, and Legos, and Mario. I love Pepsi. Good to get to know you. Uh, and so that's who I am, and what am I here to do? I am here to help you live the best life. Ever. All right, so who is up for the best life ever? Give me a woohoo on the count of three. Ready? One, two, three. Woohoo! All right, so you're in for the best life ever, right? Uh, I've got to tell you, you've got to find the manual right here. This is a Bible. Oh my goodness, I know. Uh, some of you guys might want to turn it off right now, but don't turn it off. Hang on with me. I promise that even if you don't like that God stuff, um, I think that you will like what this has to say and it will help you to live the best life ever. So just give me a chance. If your life doesn't get better within a couple months and from doing all the stuff that this Bible stuff has to say, you can never watch my channel again and say that David person was crazy, but I really believe Believe that this will help you live the best life possible. Now we have to figure out what is the principle. No, I'm, there's a little confusion. Some of you guys are thinking that old guy at your school that always says he wants to be your pal, not a prince of pal. You know what? Let me look it up. All right, as this guy described by the dictionary, I'm going to read it off here. A fundamental truth or position that serves as the foundation for a system of belief or behavior uh, for a chain of reasoning. So that means this is the core value or belief of everything that everything else is founded on. And you know what? I got a spot to look at right here. Um, so there was this dude named Jesus, right? Pretty big deal. If you haven't heard about him, don't worry. Come back next week. We're going to talk a little bit about who God is and who Jesus is, just so that we can all be clear, because that's the second thing we got to deal with. We first got to deal with how to make my life the most awesome thing and then we got to figure out who all of this stuff is coming from. And for those of you following along at home, we're in Mark chapter 12 verse 28. Jesus answered, here's the most important one, Moses said, Israel, listen to me. The Lord is our God. The Lord is one. Love the Lord your God with all of your heart and with all your soul. Love him with all your mind and with all your strength. Now, I know that some of you guys are like, but who is this God guy? Why should I listen to him? Why should I believe him? Why should I do any of that stuff? We're going to be talking about that next week, so make sure you come back on Sunday to talk a little bit more about who this God guy is. But the important thing here is that Jesus does not stop there. He keeps going. So we should keep going because Jesus actually decided there were two things that were so important. They were actually intertwined and you can't have one without the other. The second, love your neighbor as yourself. There's no commandment more important than any of these. If you want the best possible life, Jesus is saying, all you gotta do, this is the secret. I got the secret. This is the secret. The secret is to love your neighbor as yourself. Cause what about you guys? Do you guys treat yourself pretty good? Give me a thumbs up if you treat him really good. Give me a thumbs down. If you treat him really bad, go right now, do it. Yes, you treat yourself really well, right? And I think, I bet most of you guys want other people to be treated well too. So if you love them like you love yourself, that means you treat them nice, you talk well of them, you um, are friends with them, even, this is the difficult one, people who are your enemies. If you are nice long enough to your enemies, some of those enemies are gonna turn around and become friends to you because they're like, you know what, that guy has something I don't got and I wanna be like him. And so that is how to live the best life ever, to get all of these friends and, and then they're, you know what, you, the other great thing about friends and the other great things about treating other people as yourself is that when you treat other people like yourself, they will help you make sure that you have everything you need because you're such a good guy that they will love you. And so that's, that's the secret here. Live the best life. Love the Lord your God with all your heart, with all your soul, with all your mind, with all your strength, and to love your neighbor as yourself. That is the entire thing that this entire book is about and why we have this channel. We're going to try and make this elementary, try and make this easy, simple. Don't you guys know Sherlock Holmes? It's elementary, dear Watson. Of course, this is simple. Basically, what this channel is saying is that you guys can figure it out and I bet your parents could too if they listen to you because you guys are really smart and so I think that you guys are really smart and you guys can handle this. What do you think? Give me a thumbs up if you agree. Give me a thumbs down if you don't agree. Uh, let me know in the comments what you think. If you have any questions, any comments, any concerns and hey, subscribe to this channel because we're going to be talking about this stuff every single week and so if you have more stuff that you want to know, if you're like, you know what? Loving my neighbor as myself actually sounds like a pretty good idea, something that I can do. I would love for you to subscribe 
subscribe so that you can keep finding out more about this Bible thing and let's make it elementary together. Because if you guys can handle it, you guys are gonna change the world. Hey everybody, thanks for checking out Bible Made Elementary today. I wanna encourage you guys to click right there if you wanna go to the Wednesday video. It's We put out a video every Sunday and every Wednesday and the next video will be up on Wednesday to talk about how to apply this stuff to your daily life, how to love others as yourself. Uh, click right there in the middle to go to all of our other videos that we have. You'll get a playlist um, and you can check out all the other videos. We don't have a lot right now, but there will be in the future and that will grow. So uh, click there and then click at the bottom to follow us on Facebook. I would love to have you guys talk to us on Facebook um, or on our Twitter. So check those out. Uh, thanks for checking out Bible Made Elementary today. Give me a high five on the count of three. Ready? One, two.